The collaborative wiki mode, as opposed to the individual wiki mode in Moodle 2.0, is especially useful for group projects as well as whole class work. Using a wiki with an entire class of students, you know, 25 or 30 students, can get tricky because only one person at a time can edit one single wiki page. So if I made an example like class lecture notes and asked my students to add their notes from the lecture below, only one student at a time would be able to work on the page. If your project truly does need to be one space for a large number of students, consider encouraging students to set up their own subpage. The more pages there are to your wiki, the more students will be able to work on the wiki at one time. I'll show this in a minute. I'll give my first page a name, Class Lecture Notes. Leave the wiki mode on Collaborative Wiki and set it to be HTML format, which again will give my students the most flexibility in formatting their notes. Click Save and Display. The first thing that a student will need to do is click Create Page to start a new page in the class lecture notes. They can then paste in the notes from that day's lecture. Remember when I suggested that you can increase the efficiency of many students editing a wiki by adding more subpages? That can be done like this. Go into the Edit tab and create a subpage. And closing it in double brackets. This is wiki markup language allowing you to add a subpage. Click Save, and the words the first half of the lecture will become what is known as a stub. A stub means a page has been started but hasn't been filled in yet. If I click on the first half of the lecture and create a page, then one student could be working on the first half of the lecture while another student is working on another segment. Again, the goal here is to get the most number of students working as possible, when your activity must involve the whole class working together. Whenever possible, breaking students up into smaller groups that can each have their own wiki to work on is a more efficient way to use the wiki in Moodle. You could do this for any number of group projects where students must work together to develop a document or a presentation. Title your wiki Group Project or whatever the name of the project is. Provide a description. Give your first page a name. And leave the mode set to Collaborative Wiki and HTML. Before you save and display, turn on your group mode. Change it from No Groups to Separate or Visible Groups. Separate Groups means each group will have their own wiki, but they won't be able to see the wikis of other groups, and visible means they'll have their own wiki, but they will be able to pop over to the wikis of other working groups. I'm going to choose separate groups for now, and save and display. Now, each group will have their own wiki to work on, where they can initiate a new page and begin to flesh out their project. Note, you must set up groups in your course overall and assign students into those groups in your course administration area. If you're not sure how to do this, check out my tutorial on groups and groupings. Once a group begins working on a page or a project with each other, they can leverage the Comments tab to manage discussion, the History tab to see versions of the project as it develops and compare the differences, can use the Map tab to get around and see a site map of their entire wiki, and also add files such as documents and images that may support their project. For example, if we click on Files and Edit Wiki Files, students as well as teachers can upload files that support the wiki. This was not possible in Moodle 1.9 and is a nice new feature allowing students to make their wikis much more rich. They could grab image files, documents, presentations, whatever they'd like. 
The Administration tab is the tab that allows students and teachers to manage the pages inside their wiki. If they wanted to remove a page or delete all old versions of a page, they could do so to keep their wiki nice and trim. Those are just some of the ways that you can use the wiki in a collaborative mode, either with an entire class of students by encouraging the creation of subpages, maximizing the number of users who can be in the wiki at once, or by creating a group wiki, turning on the groups mode and allowing subgroups of students to each have their own wiki area. If you're looking for ideas for individual wiki use, switch to that tutorial.